Welcome back to episode 5 of Cooking with Vincent, where I am doing the guacamole or avocado spread recipe from the restaurant called The Rivoli in Mexico. Apparently, this is a restaurant that Vincent and Mary enjoyed going to because almost every recipe on the menu is in the cookbook. I traveled to San Antonio to make this recipe. I am at my friend Joanna's house. And there, this recipe has quite a few modifications. It calls for two large avocados. It calls for one entire onion. I cut that in half and then I cut it in half again. So my recipe has a quarter of an onion to it. This recipe also calls for something interesting, which is mayonnaise. I am at Joanna's house. They are vegan, so I am making it vegan so we can all enjoy it. The Hellman's mayo tastes exactly like regular mayo in the event you need one that is vegan. That is a good option to go for. This recipe also does not call for cilantro, but it calls for an eighth of a teaspoon of coriander, dried coriander, so that went in. So here's the guacamole. And now here is going to be lengthy discussion. So in Vincent's recipe and his like blurb that he talks about, he says we can eat this with matzo or English biscuits. You did not use a whole onion, but you did use onion. I used a quarter a of quarter. an onion. And that was still that was a lot of onion. Okay. I don't think this is going to taste good. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell is that big? Is that onion? Dude, just wait until you hear about the onion. Probably. Oh! Not as bad as I expected. I kind of like it. Huh. Honestly, not as bad as I expected. I want, huh. there, I want there to be herbaceous, fresh cilantro. Yeah. Preferably mm. not an eighth of a teaspoon of coriander. Right. Mm. Not as bad as I expected. <laughs> I mean, I really was expecting it to be bad, especially since the thing says two lime, two avocados and a whole onion. And I put in a quarter it is very oniony. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And oh. people who have things about onion. I have things about onion. Are especially the difference between raw and cooked onion. Yeah. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of raw onion. I know. Yeah. Um, if this was served to me in a restaurant, I would eat it. Okay. 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 So, on a scale of one With to full ten. onion, if a full onion was served with it, no. There's no way I'm eating that. Yeah, I agree. Mm -hmm. It okay. powered off for some reason. One to 10? Yeah, on a scale of one to 10, one being what the hell and 10 being, this is the best thing I've ever had in my life. All right. Um, I'll give it a six. Also a six. Now here's okay. the thing. Not the best, not the worst. Guacamole is one of my five top favorite foods. Yeah. I'm planning to get a guacamole tattoo at some point. Right. Mm -hmm. If this were on a guacamole scale of one to ten. Okay, on a guacamole scale of one three. to ten. Three. <laughs> it's, I'm not mad. Okay. Okay. What do you think? <laughs> you rate it. I don't. Mm -hmm. So I have a thing with onions. I don't care for raw onion. I don't, it's a texture thing. Mm -hmm. It's also very- I don't like onion, period. But Raw I'll, onion is so- So if it was me, I would have like dumped in just like some onion powder. Mm -hmm. Or a desiccated onion. Mm -hmm. Cause that I seem to be fine with. Pure texture thing. I also really love green onion in wok. Mm -hmm. I thought about bringing a shallot, but Mark said that shallot would be a bad idea. No, love shallot. Especially considering how little garlic is in this. Right. The recipe called for half of a clove. I put in a clove and yeah. I think it needs, I think it could have used a lot more. It could have used two cloves. I'm mm -hmm. gonna give it a solid four. Mm-hmm. 
Only because of the onion situation. Mm -hmm. Like you said, if this had a whole onion in it, I, I would not I would that. flip the table. No. Yeah. The onion is too sharp. Yeah. I mean, that's what's causing the discourse. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Vincent, what were onions just very, very small then? I don't know. I don't know what a 1965 onion. Maybe the only onions that Vincent kept around were those little onions that people put in cocktails. <gasps> They're very small. They are very small. Mm -hmm. What are you doing, you weirdo? Okie dokie. Thank you.